Hello friends, in this video we shall learn how to construct 60 degree and 120 degree angles by using compass. Maybe in your lower classes you have learned how to draw different angles by using protector. But here we will not use protector, we will use compass to draw different angles. After that we will learn how to construct angle bisector. So first we will begin with construction of angle 60 degree. To draw a 60 degree angle we need to draw a ray. First we will draw a ray with the help of a ruler or scale. And at the end of the day, give a point and name it as A. And on other side of the ray, you can give name B. So the name of the ray is A B. Now keeping the point of the compass at A and by taking any radius, we'll draw one arc here. Like this, we'll draw one arc by taking any radius. Radius you can take of any measures. Now you see both the arc and the line segment intersect at this point, say this point is D. Now taking D as center and with same radius, we will cut the previous arc. See the two arc cut each other at this point, say C. Now by joining point A and C, we will get our 60 degree angle. So we will draw a ray which must pass through the point A and C. In this way, we finish our 60 degree angle. Angle CAB is 60 degree. The steps are very easy. First, you draw a ray. After that, taking the end point of the ray as center, draw an arc. And with that same radius, draw another arc which cut the previous arc. The first cut will be your 60 degree angle. Now we will construct 120 degree. Same steps we will follow. First we will draw a ray. After that taking the end point of the ray as center, we will draw one arc. Say AB is our ray. Now taking A as center and with some radius, we will draw one arc here. Now the arc and the ray intersect at this point, say D. Now taking D as center and with same radius, we will cut the arc. Now this first cut is your 60 degree as we have done here. But we don't need 60 degree, we need 120 degree. So, this point will take us center and with same radius we will do another cut. Now up to here this is your 60 degree but we need 120 degree so you need to join this point. Say this point is your C. Now we will draw a ray which must pass through the point A and C. This angle is 120 degree. Angle CAB is 120 degree. Thus, you need to remember that for 60 degree, you need to do one cut. But for 120 degree, we need to do two cut. With same radius, we need to cut this arc two times. Now, we will learn how to construct angle bisector. Angle bisector means we will divide a given angle into two equal part or two equal halves. Suppose here, angle ABC is given. Now we need to bisect this angle means we have to divide this angle into two equal parts. So how will you do? First we will take this vertex, vertex P as center and we will draw one here arc. By taking any radius you draw one arc here. You take this vertex as center and by taking any radius you draw one here arc. Now you see this arc and the two arms intersect at this two point here and here. Now we will keep our compass at this two point and we will draw two arc here such that the two arc must intersect. Now we will place the compass at this point and by taking any radius we will draw one arc here. Similarly by taking this point as center we will draw another arc such that the two arc must intersect. See, the two arc intersect at this point. 
now we'll draw a ray which must pass through this point b and through this point in this way we bisect the angle a b c into two equal halves or two equal angles so this two angle will be equal measure now by using same method we'll bisect angle 60 degree here already arc is drawn now we'll place our compass at this two point c and d now we'll draw two arc such that the two arc must intersect here we'll draw two arc such that the two arc must intersect first we'll take d as center and with some radius we'll draw one here arc after that we'll take c as center and with same radius we'll draw another arc see the two arc intersect at this point now we'll join point a and this point here one part will be 30 degree and other part will be 30 degree since this total angle is 60 degree so one part will be 30 other part will be 30 you can use protector and you can measure in this way we finish angle bisector by using this simple step you can construct angle bisector wherever necessary